Ridge State Park and the Laurel Hill settlement within Laurel Ridge State Park has had people living at it since at least the 1820s. They were African-American men and uh, their families that, that came here and basically they're along an early road that went up over the ridge and they picked a nice flat spot and began to have a settlement here that lasted for eight generations up into the late 1960s. I had no idea about the site until Ben had contacted me that he had secured a grant for working on the project. When we first heard about this site, it was sort of treated and talked about as being unknown, that it was kind of a secret place. And it turns out that there are lots and lots of community members that know a lot more than we would ever find out just by looking at the archival record. So the cemetery is the most obvious thing on the landscape. When you come up here, it's the, the most noticeable piece and it cues you in that there were a lot of people who must have lived around here. The cemetery was used from again, about the 1820s up into the 1950s, but interspersed around are some of the artifacts, the broken pottery, the glass that was left behind by the, the residents of this, of this landscape. And there are a number of apple trees across the site. There's some other maple trees. Um, there's some sassafras trees. And from the oral history, we know people were using these. Faculty and students from geography and history and anthropology all working together. So they're learning skills that you would expect from a historian or archaeologist or a geographer in terms of how to do research and how to look at material cultures so or artifacts to understand the past. IEP's anthropology program is very involved. It is designed specifically to help train students to get into some of the more uh, practical fields like applied archaeology, CRM work, and historic preservation. I think one of the most exciting parts of a research project is when you do feel like something comes alive, it takes it from being a flattened experience in an archive or on a page to being something that is much more tangible.